Hello and welcome to Stotros Maths key skill video on finding the distance given the average speed and time. We have this problem here. A car drives for 3 hours 12 minutes at an average speed of 57 miles per hour. What distance in miles does it travel? Now in previous videos we saw something called this SDT triangle like this. And remember we could use this triangle in three different ways. So if we put a line like this in our triangle then we can see the D is above the T. And what we do is to say that the speed is the distance over the time. So the distance divided by the time. And in another video, we saw that we could add the line like this to find the time. So the time is the distance over the speed. So the distance divided by the speed. But there's one final way you can put the line to get the D on its own. And it's like this. And now you can see that the distance is the speed times the time. Now remember when we have two things next to each other in algebra, we times them. But you could put a little times here. So the distance is the speed times the time. So let's get our S and T from here. The speed is equal to 57 miles per hour. And we need the time as well. But notice the distance is in miles and this speed is in miles per hour. So we want this 3 hours 12 minutes just in hours, not in hours and minutes. So the time is 3 hours and 12 minutes. Now let's convert this to decimal form. It's not 3.12, that doesn't work. But let's think, well 12 minutes is what fraction of an hour? Well an hour is 60 minutes, so it's 3 hours and 12 sixtieths of an hour. Because in a full hour of 60 minutes, we've got 12 of those minutes. And if we actually did 12 over 60 on our calculator to work that out as a decimal, we can see it's a fifth, which is 0.2. So we can press the SD key, we can see it's 0.2, so it's 3.2 hours. And then we can just shove in our formula. So the distance is the speed times the time. So it's the speed of 57, multiply the time of 3.2. And if I do that on my calculator, I get 182.4, and what's a unit? Well, this is miles per hour, and this is hours. We've got miles there, so it's going to be 182.4 miles.